Rebel Dogs Heroic Tales of Trusty Hounds by Kimberly Hamilton. Buddy, America's first seen eye dog. Before there were guide dogs in the USA blind, people had to depend on others for pretty much everything. But all of that changed thanks to a dog named Buddy. In 1927, a popular magazine published an article about a program in Europe that trained dogs to be guides for war-blinded soldiers. The father of 19-year-old Maurice Frank wrote to the author, an American dog breeder and trainer living in Switzerland, Dorothy Harrison Erstes, and begged her to help his son who had lost sight in both eyes. The woman invited Maurice to come and meet her and introduced him to a beautiful and keenly intelligent German shepherd. Maurice called her buddy and they spent several months learning how to walk together, communicating through the stiff handle of her harness. When Morris returned to New York City, a throng of journalists eagerly waited, eagerly, eagerly waited to see America's first guide dog nurse. One reporter dared him to cross the street jammed with taxis and people and buses. It was a bigger challenge than anything Morris and Buddy had ever faced in training, but she coldly navigated the traffic like a champ. Morris went on to establish the CNI, the best guide dog school in the USA. With Buddy on his side, he fought to change laws so that visually impaired people would be allowed to go anywhere with their dogs, including restaurants, workplaces, and public transport. Morris liked to say that Buddy had given him the divine gift of freedom. She pulled the way of thousands of other service dogs walking today. 1928-1938, USA. Hounds that love to help. But it was more than Morick's friend's best friend. She helped him regain his confidence, regain, regain his confidence and independence. These days, service dogs, aka assistant dogs, help people in all kinds of ways. Guide dogs lead visually impaired people around the obstacles. They've been assisting blind people for centuries, as far back as ancient Roman times. Hearing dogs help people who are deaf or hearing impaired, alerting them to noises such yeah. as alarms, doorbells, or crying babies. Mobility assistant dogs like the one belonging to former U.S. President George uh, H.W. Bush Suey can Bush. open Bush Bush Suey can open dolls, doors, retrieve items on command and do all sorts of other everyday tasks. Sully even helped the late president cast a ballot in an ele ele election. Diabetic colored dogs can detect chemical changes in blood sugar and either alert the human or sound an alarm if medical help is needed. Laser response dogs are trained to bark or to press an alarm if someone is having an epileptic seizure. They can also move them to a safe place and fetch medicine or a phone. Uh, psychiatric. 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 Psychiatric service dogs assist people dealing with emotional conditions like depression, anxiety, 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 and post-traumatic stress disorder (PTSD). Autism support dogs are a big help for kids on the spectrum. They act as an icebreaker in social situations and are a comforting friend in times of stress. Allergy detection dogs are trained to sniff out allergens such as peanuts or gluten. They are often perish with children. Several dogs fall of fame. Angel was a Labrador Retriever that was the most famous assistant dog in the UK. He knew over a hundred voice comments and hand signal signals, could fetch it items from shelves, load an empty while washing machine and even get money out of a cash machine. He was awarded a PDSA gold medal and voted several dogs of the millennium. Did you know, service dogs are trained to take a nature break on demand?